Hello viewers, welcome back to our channel, Bangladeshi Canadian Couple. My name is Galib. My name is Aki. We are from Saskatoon, Canada. And today we are standing right in front of Seacom Radio Station. It's a special day because we were interviewed by Seacom Radio Station. যখন সিকম রেডিও থেকে ডেভিডের কাছ থেকে আমন্ত্রণ পাই আমাদের ইন্টারভিউর জন্য আমরা বেশ খুশি হয়েছি আজকে দুটো পনেরো মিনিটে ইন্টারভিউ ছিল আমার যদিও কাজ ছিল আমি ইন্টারভিউ থাকতে পারিনি কিন্তু আঁকি ইন্টারভিউ দিয়েছে কারণ আঁকি এখন হোম অফিস করছে সে কারণে আঁকি এই ইন্টারভিউটা ফোনে দিয়েছে আমরা রেডিও থেকে ইন্টারভিউর জন্য আমন্ত্রণ পেয়েছি কারণ আমরা বাংলাদেশিদের ইমিগ্রেন্ট লাইফস্টাইল ক্যানাডায় কেমন হয়ে থাকে সেই বিষয়ের উপর ভিডিও বানিয়ে থাকি এবং আঁকি আমাদের সাস্কাটুন ডুয়েলারদের জন্য ইংরেজিদের ভিডিও বানিয়ে থাকে সেই কারণে আমরা আমন্ত্রণ পেয়েছি So on the afternoon show, uh, it's called Saskatchewan Afternoon, David Critton is the host and he contacted us to interview us about our channel. Um, so the reason he interviewed us is because he heard from his friends that we make videos for people like you, for people that live in Bangladesh, as well as I make videos in English for people that live in Canada. So he decided to interview us. So we're going to watch some of the clips now. Let's watch. Families and caregivers. With the highest quality of support services, click on events page at ckom.com. Saskatchewan Afternoon with David Curtin <laughs> on 650 CKOM. Hosnera Kanam and, and her husband, Galib, are from Bangladesh, but they now live in Saskatoon. And this couple has a YouTube account. It's called the Bangladeshi Canadian Couple. And, and here's what they do. They make videos for those who are well, basically still living in Bangladesh, but who are moving to Canada, and in some cases, specifically Saskatchewan. You know, videos like how to apply for a driver's license. They've got uh, travel tips and, and newcomer stories and what life in Canada is like. All named at the Bangladesh community. Now, the Bangladesh people who live still in Bangladesh Hasnara Kanam is on the line with me uh, right now. Hey, good afternoon. Hi, good afternoon. How are you? Good. How did this start? First of all, how long have you been in Canada? How long have you as a couple been in Canada? Oh, wow. So I've been in Canada for over 25 years. All right. I, uh, I married Galib in 2007, and he came to Canada in 2009. So how did the idea of creating a YouTube account called Bangladeshi Canadian Couple come into play? Um, so it started, we started our channel last year, July of 2019. And uh, when we actu actually, when we first started, we had no idea what this was going to be about. <laughs> so if you look at our YouTube channel, we have no introduction videos. Um, Galib and I went to a picnic at uh, Prince Albert and we decided to film and then we uploaded the video and we had so many people comment and wanting to know more about our culture and more about what we do in Canada, so we decided to continue from there on. Well, and now you've become like, uh, I'm, I'm going to use the term, mini YouTube stars. Yes. <laughs> you've, you've got thousands of views on these, on these videos. You, are you, what, what kind of reaction are you getting from those back in your home country? Back in our home country, people are loving it. Um, actually, a lot of people comment asking us to film different topics. For example, <laughs> one, um, a lot of our viewers um, requested a video on how we survive in Canadian or Saskatchewan winter. <laughs> how we survive in minus 52. So we did film a video on that last year. And we had thousands of views on that as well. And you have fun with these videos. It's not, I mean, it's not serious stuff. You have a lot of fun by the looks of it. It's more fun than anything, yes. <laughs> so, uh, Galib's the star, I guess, isn't he? He is. <laughs> he comes up with most of the ideas, that's for sure. <laughs> he's not afraid of the... Or, and he's not shy of the camera. And, he, and, and, and a lot of these things are, um, what do you call them, instructional videos. And so I, I got to give you a lot of praise on that. You, 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 you make it very clear on, on things like, you know, applying for a driver's license and the like. It's, it's, it's valid information for people who want to come to Canada. Thank you. Yes, we do try to make it educational, but fun as well. Yeah, <laughs> and you've, you've succeeded uh, on, on both parts. Do you plan to continue this? 
We do. Um, so I do film a lot of videos in English. Uh, for example, one day last couple of years ago, um, I was searching on a video on what winter shines in Saskatoon is like, and I could not find a single video of anyone that filmed or showcased what the festival winter shines is like in Saskatoon. So last year, Galip said, why don't we make a video? So I did film a video that's completely in English, and uh, I tried to show what winter shines is all about. And I loved it. I loved it so much that we decided we're going to continue making events uh, that happens in Saskatoon in English and then uh, different informative videos in Bengali, which is our native language. Oh, fantastic. So we can all enjoy these now then. So, yes, for sure. So we look for Bangladeshi Canadian couple on YouTube. That's, that's yes. what we want to subscribe to, right? Yes. Okay. So uh, I want to ask you this question. Your first um, winter <laughs> in Saskatchewan. Do you remember it? I know it was tw over two decades ago, but do you remember that first winter? It was tough. I remember because um, <laughs> I actually grew up in Toronto. Oh, okay. And the winter in Toronto is nothing compared to the winter in Saskatchewan. <laughs> and I remember Dalit and I went out one day and um, he said, my ears are frozen. <laughs> <laughs> so that's never happened before. My ears are frozen. Um, so we, we learned to adapt and we learned um, the different ways that we can keep ourselves warm. I had a sister-in-law who was a newcomer and, and uh, the, one of the uh, family um, traditions, I guess, uh, is to play uh, hockey on, on Boxing Day, or, you know, street hockey on Boxing yeah. Day. And it was one of these really, really warm winters. It was literally close to um, the melting point, right? It was that warm. And she, it was her first winter uh, from the Philippines. <laughs> And she had, uh, I think, four coats on, and you, you couldn't see her face or anything like that. But those first winters are brutal. And you they get, are. Well, they're all brutal, but I mean, that, those first ones when you when you have no idea what to uh, what to expect, you know, what to feel, and that's the challenge you have when you talk to people in Bangladesh. You cannot tell them what minus forty feels like. Exactly, they have no idea, and that's why on our video um, about how to survive in minus 52, we talked about heating, because in Bangladesh, the houses don't have heating at home. Oh. So we showed that we have a heating system here at home, in the car, so there's really nothing to worry about, but it's just that they don't know, and that's one of the reasons why we make videos, is to just to let them know that it's nothing to be scared of. <laughs> it's a phenomenal idea, and I'm glad that you, uh, you guys are going to carry it on, because I, I just think, and, and to include the English uh, versions as well so that we can all enjoy them. I'm, I'm looking forward to all of your new videos. Thanks very much for this. Thank you so much. Take care. Uh, you too. Thanks for having me. Thank you. Hasnera Kanam and her husband, uh, Galab. They're from Bangladesh, and if you want to subscribe to their YouTube account, it's called Bangladeshi Canadian Couple. Thank you so much for watching everyone. Shabai Amadajuna Dua Kurben. Allah Fis. Allah